Hey everyone, it's Velvet. Welcome back to more Castlevania Harmony of Distance. And the last one, we started actually exploring uh, Castle B and fought some bosses. We fought the uh, Peeping Big, it was called, as well as Legion, which is a uh, very cool, very iconic boss fight and just overall demon. Hello! So now let's, let's continue exploring. Uh, this looks basically the same as it did in Castle A. The sky is a different color. It's got it's got a green filter now, um, though it's largely the same. He's gonna charge! Uh, yeah, I think I would rather have taken the damage just running into him than against that charge attack. Uh, was this? Oh, we got some turkey. Okay, so we at least were able to make it one more down here, but this, I believe, was closed originally. I want to say, hi. Get over here. Um, hmm. The way that this is open makes me think that this is probably the way the game wants me to proceed. So I think I'm actually going to double back for just a second. Actually, do I double back? I'm thinking about it. Mm, we can come back later if we come across a dead end. Let's just keep going. Let's keep our forward momentum. We'll, we'll explore everything eventually. I don't particularly want to fight these guys anymore though, so I'm just gonna dash past them. Aqueduct of dra- oh god, not, not dragons. Bone liquid. I'm a bit concerned about about sewers, especially because or aqueduct, especially because it like gave us an anti venom as we dropped in melty zombie. Yeah, yeah, sure, all right. That sure is a liquid zombie. <laughs> that just keeps showing up on top of... <laughs> on top of, like, the... <laughs> paths of water. Man, the drinking water in this castle must be absolutely rancid. So we got multiple directions on this side. What about the other side? Another melty zombie for starters. And an or 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 or. And an elixir. Glad I came I came this way. Okay, let's Let's go start from the top and go in like a clockwise direction. Hey, save point. I'll take that. Glad I came this way, so now I know where it is. Yep. yep. <sighs> what a terrifying room. How am I, like, meant to respond to this? Other than just tanking all that damage. I'm gonna go back to the save point after this, thanks. <laughs> I'm probably gonna need the potions. They're okay, so they just continually respawn. Gotcha. Understood. Um, let, let's use one of their potions.
but there was something. Oh, right. Uh, anti venom. Oh, I only have one of those. I'm gonna have to be pretty careful. And then this is like. Oh, this brings me back here on the other side of the place I got cut off in, it looks like. Okay. Um. Well, let's... Let's see what we can do about the wall from this side, then. Can we do anything? N no? Okay. If we can't do anything, we can't do anything. But we do... We do- oh, hello. We do have both sides filled in on the map now. So that, at least, is very nice. And then... A medicine jar? What? What do that do? Makes you invincible for a set time. Okay. And then do we just... Yeah, we, we lower this here. Gotcha. You can hear machines moving above. So that item... We should... Oh, hello. That item that we saw, we should be able to get now. Ooh. I didn't handle that particularly great. Uh, the problem with that is, like, this should be closed, right? So, we'd have to run all the way back around to get that item. I almost want to do it. Uh, oh god, I'm, like, standing on top of... Let me through! <laughs> Thank god. Yeah, I almost want to go and get that item now. Uh, I'm going to save here. And rather than make you watch me go all the way back, I'm just gonna go... I'm just gonna go rush to that item, and, uh, see what the hell it is. Nani? And we got the Crushing Stone, which does... It's not a relic. Is it an equip, then? Oh, by holding attack down, a charged attack can break some walls. Is that how I get back? Is this like a shortcut for me now? Also, what does that do to my, my damage? It's less damage, so it's probably something I only, I only want to, please, damn it. Please. It's probably something I only want to equip when I'm trying to break through walls. But... Oh, hello. If this is what it's for, that's actually awesome. Okay, let's see. I have to charge it up. How do I know it's it's full? When I'm flashing like this? No. So clearly Clearly this doesn't work on this wall. So, I'll have to experiment on other walls. That's a damn shame. Nani? 
Nani? Ancient armor? How is that? Marginally better. Okay. And you know what? I feel like having some some more luck to offset that. Let's do that. Nani? Okay, let's... I said I'd go uh, clockwise, so let's go to the right first this time. Uh, just a lot of melty zombies in Arabaki, I see. Uh, and a life max up. So, completely worth it. Do these, do these guys melt back? No, they don't. Uh, they just... I, I guess I should have killed them on the way here. They don't take too many hits, so it's fine. But I guess they vomit up more of them? I... See... That's free experience, I guess. And they're not too terribly threatening, even though I obviously just panicked. So it's fine. It's fine. We take the... Hello? Pipe. Uh, I sense that this room floods eventually. That's just a guess. For now, I'll take the Uncurse Potion, though. I don't like that pipe. I'm gonna be thinking about that pipe and what its implications are. Terrifying. Thank you. Uh, let's keep going. Oh, hello! Dragon level... Just, just regular white dragon, okay. Not even blue eyes. Okay, I see. So this one is breaking. So this one I should be able to break with a full charge. Okay. I understand now. And what do we got here? An Earth Ring? What do the Earth Ring do? Increases the strength of the Holy Book. So we, we get a better Bible. Oh, are we... Oh, does this reconnect us with, back with... Yes, it does. Kind of. It reconnects us, but not with the mobility we have. We still need to be able to get, like, the high jump boots, or, like, a wall jump, or something. Um... I see... that this doesn't actually end here. Ah! Like Zelda 2. I understand. And we get life max from that. Um... Is this all we do here? It looks like we're done here. So I guess... We have one of two options. We can continue exploring the rest of the dark blue area here in Castle B, or we can double back all the way to Castle A. Uh, I would like to keep my forward momentum for now. Because, like, I'm sure there are some areas in Castle A that are now open to us, now that we have the Crushing Stone and the, the double jump. But I would like to keep my forward momentum. So let's explore the rest that we can in the areas that we have directly in front of us. Nani. The return back to the light realm, as well as dashing into enemies that can still that can still hurt me. Uh, hello. Was there 
anything over here worth? Ah, yes. This this was the way to just ascend to, to, to the dream. Let's check this way first, yeah? Because it, it feels like there's less that will to explore in this direction. Is that a rocking chair? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Is that a jukebox? An old right? And it's a jukebox. Yeah, all right. We take those. I have no idea what I picked up. Um, it, it, it went by in a flash before the flying bone. Uh, that painting is covered in blood. Ruler sword level three? That's terrifying. I want to feed it, but like I'm horrified of it. I want to kill it at least, well, there we go. I was gonna say, I want to kill it at least once. But, um, I got my wish. All right, cool, let's get the hell out of here. Let's not take on that thing again. You guys leave me alone. <laughs> I swear to God. Ah, that is that would be the way the way back. So let's keep going. Ooh, more more wall I break down. But first, let's down a potion. I'm not super confident about my health. <laughs> There's a max life up right on the other side of this door. <laughs> of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? <laughs> Ooh, uh, wrong button. We got a boss. Let's see what we got. Maxim. Oh, I see you're still alive. Maxim. No, you're not Maxim. You're on to me. What the hell are you? I am... myself. Just not the me that you knew in the past. This man's suppressed desires, coupled with his possession of Dracula's remains, gave rise to a separate spirit. And... that other spirit is me. I'm not even sure if he's aware of my existence. And it was also you who kidnapped Liddy? <laughs> of course it was my doing. She belongs to me. But he went and lost his memory and doesn't even know where she is. But he will retrieve his memory soon. When he does, she'll be all mine. Damn you! Sure about that? If I die, your best friend will perish with me. Ugh! Your death is at hand. Die, you vile dog! Shine! Uh, okay. So, what are we doing here? Shadow? Hello! He- he run! He sure do run into me. Okay, so we can only... We can only attack him when he manifests as something. Understood. So when it turns into the... the, I think it's a boss in Link's Awakening <laughs> that I'm thinking of. When he turns into this, yeah. I think this is just the Nightmare of the Windfish. Not me. I don't have any anti-venom, so we're just gonna have to, to deal with that poison damage. But yeah, when he when he's in this form, we can't do anything about him. Hello, Bobcat. Why is the Bobcat howling?
The bobcat is dead. Moth, panther, and sword. So that is a dead end for us then. I'm surprised we didn't like even get a relic out of that. Like is was that just for its own sake? Just just for story progress to learn that if you kill Dark Maxim, Maxim dies, I suppose. Maybe that 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 maybe that's a hint for a later boss fight that we need we need to do something special like in in Symphony of the Night where you need certain gear before you take on Richter or else you get a, a bad ending. I'm being juggled. Um let's go to the save point first and then we will ascend. I think that's the best plan. Probably. Uh, and on that note, I think we shall end things here. Thank you so very much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed, and if you did, uh, consider subscribing and all that. Until next time, please have a fantastic day, alright?